Hey there, welcome back to Tales of Berseria, where last time we entered Palamedes and uh, did some kind of mundane challenges. So there's an exorcist on the clear opposite side of a demon, obviously not doing his job. But that's okay. Also, an exposition came by to deliver me two losses and a win, you son of a bitch. Okay. <laughs> If I remember correctly, there should be a dangerous something or other in here. Let's go! Well, it wiped out the security for us, but... Well, look at that. Wolfie's got the crest of Amenoch. The same pendant worn by priestesses. Then that makes this demon! Yeah, she must be the missing mother, Mahina. It can't be. I knew I was going to end up having to fight this thing. Well, you're obviously not having problem be uh, fighting it. Good lord. Ow! Let's charge up real quick. Cool! Got us all back. Let's use it! Not too bad. Haha, <laughs> right into the fireball. God, this thing's weak. I was scared of this for nothing. Ow. Far too many enemies can break your guard. It makes it almost useless. Yeah! Done! To think a priestess, beloved by her village, would become a demon. Eleanor? She's never going to be the same again. This is the least I can do for her. So says Reason. Huh? That feeling! <laughs> Damn! <sighs> Let the demon be. We don't need it. Something tells me Luffy that's going to discover something. Ooh, he might be able to return demons back to their human form. Wouldn't that be amazing? Let's get a new save going. Alright. We have our work cut out for us. Enemies at every turn. I'm ready for this. Okay, you were not doing your job! You're letting demons fight alongside you! Guess I have to put you out of your misery. <laughs> oh, you know what? This might be the start of Eleanor discovering more, uh, kind of dire secret- dire secrets? Kind of bad se You know what? I don't know the right word to use! Discovering something interesting about the Abbey and how bad they can be. The fact that they kind of let the priestess turn. I don't doubt that. I do. Hey, turn around. That's how we can get an advantage over you. You're just going to be staring straight at me? Okay. That demon. I guess she caught demon blight when she was looking for her daughter. Yeah, that's what the girl at the inn said. But even after turning into a demon, she's still searching for her daughter. Well, Rokuro, Kuragane, and Dial all remember what they wanted when they were human, right? Demon or not, she's a mother. 
It's no surprise she would still be protective of her child. It could be that. Or it could be something else. Well, I hope that's what it is. I know that must be how she felt as a human. But demons don't have a sense of motherhood or any such thing. You saw how violent she was. She's not Mahina anymore. When she became a demon, she lost all capacity for empathy and love. It's heartbreaking, but it's the truth. Velvet and Rokuro still have empathy. One demon left unchecked could take a hundred lives. And this one's even willing to attack exorcists. Demons can wipe out entire villages, even cities, just as they destroyed my village. Uh. Thus, my path is clear. Eleanor is right. There's no turning back once you've changed. Perhaps it would be a mercy to grant her peace through death. Uh. Like I said, Lafayette probably knows that there's a method down <laughs> You didn't make a sound effect, you were just like, hey, what's going on? Explanation point. Shit, stop it. Stop. I hate you. Stop it. Oh my god, you're killing me. That took a turn. Okay, calm down, you jerks. Ha! Alright. God, what was I saying? I was distracted by death and destruction. You guys, with your spears and your crap damage, I hate you. Die. There we go. That's the end of that combo. Thank you for the help there, Eleanor. Stop poking me with your stupid... Urgh. I am not okay. That is so beyond irritating. Somebody level up. Neat. Oh, it's Eleanor again. And I have leveled up. What's down here? Okay, that makes sense. Uh, God, what was I saying? Um, door. It won't open. Is there some sort of trick to it? Well, you could always try busting through it, but I wouldn't. Who knows what sort of traps you might trigger? I know, I know. Look at that diamond-shaped stone in the door. Haven't we seen that somewhere else? You're right. It was on the pedestal with that chalice. That huge thing? You must have some sharp eyes there. I was more interested in what was inside that chalice. So, what? That chalice is the key? Somehow I doubt it'll be that simple. Some stones are colored, and some aren't. It must hold some kind of significance. I think you're right. Well, yeah, I know the significance. Those two are the diamond ones, which probably corresponded to those two doors that I opened up, with those two chalices, and that's the one that opened up the door here. It's not difficult. You guys act like everything's so hard. God. Treat me with a little respect, please. I know what I'm doing. I'm also being chased by something. Whoa, it stopped chasing me. Uh, God, what was I talking about? Um... So, uh, Eleanor's, like, the only reason why Eleanor feels that way is because her, um, uh, home village was destroyed by a whole bunch of demons. Um, uh, but, uh, just like uh, Livy said, said um, uh, Velvet and Rokuro still have empathy. Or empathy. Which means that obviously what Eleanor thinks is incorrect. Did you see my complete and utter victory? It's not like becoming a demon just means that you're nothing but that. Is Inomi not really an Empyrean? What makes you ask that all of a sudden? Well, according to the song Grimm deciphered, Inominat is an eight-headed dragon, right? The Empyreans are supposed to be these holy beings, but using Therians to feed on malevolence sounds more sinister than divine to me. You've got a point there. Empyreans are a type of Malachim, and that doesn't seem like any Malak we've seen. And even less so when we're talking an eight-headed dragon. Is it so far-fetched? What do you think will happen if the Therians come together in one place? 
Well, it wouldn't be good. My guess is they'd merge together into a giant, horrific monster. The mighty beast will attack us with its eight long, snake-like necks and eight heads spitting hellfire! Uh, I can see your worry. Right? And that's eight heads with only six of us to take them on. It'd be more than we could handle. I'd have to conjure up a double or two. You can do that? Of course not. Then why mention it? Oh! What is it, Lafayette? Do you think each head would act of its own free will? Because if they do, they'd be uncoordinated, bumping into each other and going this way and that, giving us an opening. If we fight as one united whole, I know we can win. Yes, if we work hand in hand, victory is ours. Right, everyone? Huh? Us united? Have you looked at us recently? Uh, well, I mean, maybe. That was not my intention. I actually meant to do that. Just do the walking thing because, um, uh, tilting the control stick doesn't make you walk. You actually have to press a button for that. Which is great. And I tried to press that button, just so happens that button is right next to the Y button. Thank you! Sweet! Another level up. So, let's see where this door goes. I'm assuming it just goes around. Hey, buddy! Oh, I think I know where I am. If I am not mistaken, this very well might be that area I went to and decided to back out from. Ow, ow, ow! Yeah! Let's switch back to the bit. Sweet! Let's take you out. Oh, you're just killing all of them. Sweet. You're not hurt, are you? No, I'm fine. Cool. More tutorial. Sweet. Whoa! Dangerous encounter. Hmm. That's odd. Why do I suddenly have all my souls? I think I began this uh, fight with four, but I didn't get an advantage encounter. Ugh. Ah, poison does jack shit to me. So I think I've got this! There we go. That's just one of a very many. <laughs> it becomes so much easier when I keep getting enough souls to pull off of. Ow. Pull off. Break soul? <laughs> All right, let's take care of this one. How many do I have left? That's a good indication. He just kind of showed up. Yeah. Sweet. All right. I think that took care of all of them that was here. Oh no, this isn't the area. It must be on the other side. But I do remember that waterfall. There's more waterfalls. Alright. Chalice number four, I think. That takes care of that. That also means that the door should have another gym lit, uh, lit up. Here I come. 
Okay, so that was weird. I didn't start this battle with four souls. Huh. Oh, jeez. This thing's hit like a truck. Let's take care of you. Whoa! A little too late there, whoever did that. Ah, I used the last of my peach gels. Oh shit! Why? Luffy said. Oh jeez, who did that? Fascinating. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay, that could have been bad. So far, my health is fine. So long as we don't wind up getting another dangerous encounter. Oh, it was necessary. Oh, that's cool. Got myself another soul. Let's put it to good use. Yeah. Let's do it again. God, this combat is so much fun! I actually really love this. Alright. Pick this up. Let's see what's through door number two. As if I didn't know. Oh! It's way over there. But how? I want it! Come on! Oh. What's that do? Oh, just does that one. All right, let's see where that goes then. Still want that treasure chest. Don't know if I'll ever be able to figure out a way over there. Okay, there we go. My mic lost its connection for a second there. Okay, let's see what's through this doorway. Whoa, a crap ton of cat souls. And a monolith. Well, let's pick up everything that we see before we check out the monolith or else I'll forget, knowing me. Gold treasure chest! What do you give me, a guardian doll? Yeah, I haven't checked out the equipment for a while. Let's see what the Guardian doll does. <gasps> it's a Gradient doll! It's a new one! Sweet! What do we have for you? Uh, nothing of significant power. Oh, that is awesome! Oh, but you're magic based! Well, hmm, C considering how much it does, I don't think it's too bad. Hmm, what do we have for Rokuro here? No, that's not what I wanted! Oh my god, I can't go back! Um, hmm, this actually looks pretty good. Okay. Oh no, I don't even remember what he was using. I'll just give him that. That sounds about right. Uh, where do I go? There we go. Something is written on the monolith. The lock of the sacred sealed door is governed by the blue and white jewels of the seven chalices. When the jewels of the chalices shine, the jewels of the door shall shine alike. When the seven chal jewels shine, I was just reading chalices a lot, I thought it was coming up. In unison, the way to the inner san sanctum shall open. I knew that. You're telling me things I already know. Thank you. Uh, okay. 
Let's go down here. Let's see. So we already did that. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, never mind. It is getting a tiny bit more complicated. One of the teardrops is not lit up. Alright. Cool. This is an interesting area. Let's go up. Let's see what awaits us. Here's a teardrop. Whoa, I'm filling it up with water? Whoa! A water bridge! A water bridge that's stopped by a waterfall. So how do I cross that? Weird. And then there's still that that I can't cross either. Are there any other doors around? Hmm. Let's check something out here. And the water bridge stays! Fascinating! Alright! Let's take care of this bastard real quick! This won't be too... difficult! Thank you for the healing! Let's switch. Oh, what is that now? That was weird. Let's charge up. Oh. Its guardian was was angry at it. Hold on. You can read a guardian's heart? Um yeah, sort of. Okay, let's see what's around here then. Oh, a wall I can break. Hmm. What's down there? Hmm. Okay. Something to insert. Fascinating. Okay. So, that's the area I came from. What do I insert in there? Oh, wait. What's in here? You son of a bitch! What's the point of that? Just putting it right behind the thing! It's like having a... I don't know... Um... Left swapped banks. Cool. I, I... It's like... Having somebody locked up in a cage... Or in a jail cell... And then putting the keys in the jail cell! Uh. Cool. God, I have a headache. I'm assuming that's in the area I just left. So, here we go. This game is not known for its excellent puzzle solving. I'm, uh, I've been saying some pretty harsh things about like the hallway simulator, the d puzzle solving, all that junk. Don't get me wrong, this game is fantastic, but holy crap, I could try a little harder. Where does that send me? Hello. Um. Okay. What am I doing? That is not good. Okay, let's check out that door. 
See if anything's changed in my favor. Huh. Messed door and bed was something doesn't prevent the door from opening. The jewels are of two colors, blue and white. They resemble the jewels of the chalices. Perhaps they are connected in some way. Well, duh! <laughs> We've already made that discovery. Okay, let's see. Expedition arrived. Neat. Neato. Take a look at. Not neato. Hmm. So one of those. Oh, you know what? There might be a reason why I'm able to return to the other side. Or not. Cool. So, light that blue. Oh yeah, there is a way to return. Cause if I do that, that happens. Cool. Now I know what I'm doing. Somewhat. Um, hmm. I think it's down here. Let's go through this door and see what lies beyond it. Nothing! You guys are bad exorcists. You guys are, are bad. You can't even catch me. What are you doing here? Um... Weird. Okay. Oh, I know where it is. Um. Let's go through this door. Later. Uh, I think it's up here. It's gonna be f f fine. I have to make a choice between two doors. Any, many, many, this one. Okay, I was wrong. This one. Yeah! Teleport! Cool. Okay. So, now that I've done that... That means the light should be shining on the door. Yes, it is shining! Cool. Okay. This game's giving me the runaround. Let's see... I'm supposed to have them all shining, which means it's supposed to light all of the ones with the teardrops on them. And because I used, uh, the fire thing... That made, uh, the waterfalls disappear. Uh, so I have to do this to all the ones that I made the waterfalls disappear on. Okay. Alright, so now that I've done that, uh, that's a treasure chest area. We have to go back around, and I think there's another one on the other side, I'm not sure. Oh wait, that's looking in the wrong direction. Yep, I'm making all the right decisions. Okay, so that's the waterfall bridge of doom! Oh, that must be what the teardrop is. It's supposed to signify water. It's not a teardrop, it's a water drop, you dorks! I think it was Laffy who said it was a water drop, or a teardrop. Yeah, as soon as you activate the mechanism, nah, mechanism, you sense mana begin to per permeate the temple. You seem to have released some kind of sealed energy. Oh, dear God. What did we do? Quick save before I die, probably. Cool. Quick saved. Actually, you know what? This might be a good time to call it if I did something bad. Did I do something bad? Hello, magical door of doom. Let us save. That quick save was useless. Okay. Um, uh, thank you for watching. 
there's a little bell next. Wait. Please remember to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe to this little bell next to subscribe. And if you click it, you'll be notified of all my future uploads. Uh, God. Okay. This door of doom. We open it. And could have a boss battle beyond it. So that's fun. Um. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to see with my own two eyes what is beyond that to do or okay thank you for watching and i'll see you next time and hopefully it won't be raining because i'm pretty sure it's raining right now outside okay thank you for watching i'll see you next time goodbye